Come on, guys. This is the Daily Ramble. What's up, Pen Ridge? I'm Major Fantaski. This is Jackson Henry. We got your morning analysis for Wednesday, Hump Day, March 8th, 2017, day one on your academic schedule. From Dr. Radigan, our Takes Pride theme of the month is respect. This week's quote is from Jackie Robinson. Jackie Robinson said, I'm not concerned with your liking or disliking me. All I ask is that you respect me as a human being. Jackie Robinson took much abuse and disrespect from fellow players and fans during his career. Today, he's remembered with great respect and his jersey number 42 is retired in all Major League Baseball. Jackie earned the respect of others, but Jackie believed respect should be given, not earned. From the College and Career Center, Cadet Cardi, a current senior at the U.S. Military Academy at West Point, will be visiting this week to share information about and his experiences of the Academy. If you would like to learn more about the Academy, please register for this visit on Naviance. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Lewis in the College and Career Center, room 223. And Cedar Crest College will be hosting a college fair tonight from 6.30 p.m. until 8 p.m. The fair will be held at Lees Hall on Hunter College Drive in Allentown. This is a great opportunity to meet admissions representatives and gather information from over 100 institutions of higher education. No pre-registration is required. Also, next week we will have three branches of the military visiting, the Navy, the Army, and Air Force. If you'd like to attend any of these visits, please register on Naviance. You will receive a pass the morning of the visit. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Lewis in the College and Career Center, still room 223. Furthermore, St. Luke's University's Hospital and the Da Vinci Center are offering a free mini medical school program for high school students and adults. If you have any interest in medicine, this is an excellent opportunity to learn about the nervous system. Registration is required and space is limited. For more information, please stop by the College and Career Center in room 223 for a flyer. And attention students grades 9 to 11. Bucks County Choral Society is offering one full scholarship to the Westminster Choir College summer camps, vocal institute, and music theater workshop. Interested students can pick up the application in the College and Career Center, again, room 223. And attention students interested in forensic science. The Cedar Crest College will be hosting their 15th annual forensic science symposium on Saturday, March 25th from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. This is a free event for high school students. However, registration is required. Please stop by the, again, College and Career Center in room 223 for more information. And finally, attention class of 2017, the Penridge Community Scholarships and Awards are now available. These scholarships and awards are for your graduating class only. An email was sent last week with the details for applying. Please review the email, and if you have any questions, stop by the College and Crew Center. We'll say for the last time, room 223, to see Mrs. Lewis. Thank you. That's all from us. Off to Steve and AK with your sports. Good getting boys. Thank you, Andrew and Jackson. I'm Steve Cranick. I'm Anthony Kelly. We have your sports for today. Wrestlers, go to states. Dismiss at 11.45. And any wrestler whose season is over, please clean out your locker in the tea room by the end of this week, Friday, March 10th. Thank you. Good luck to Matt Parker and Josh Stillings at States. Go get them. Good luck, guys. And off the uh, teachers and clubs with Joe Robb. Thanks, guys. I'm Joe Robinson, and I have your teachers and clubs for today. For Mrs. Rissmiller, hey, Penneries, this week is Seatbelt Safety Week. Do you wear your seatbelt every day? If not, you should. Cars don't fly, and neither should you. Your seatbelts keep you from being thrown around in a car accident. If you do wear your seatbelt, prove it. This Friday, the first 500 people to show a sad member of a morning selfie wearing a seatbelt will receive a pack of Smarties. Please take this picture after you buckle up, but before you start to drive. Sad members will be wearing black shirts with seatbelts on them. When it comes to driving safely, be smart, Penridge. For Mrs. Grimshaw on the Key Club Food Drive, Key Club is asking for your help with the Operation Helping Hand Food Drive. Bring non-perishable food items in your ninth period class through today. The top six classes will win donuts from the Key Club. All items will collected will go to Fish, a food pantry in our community. 
from Fellowship of Christian Athletes. There is a meeting. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will be meeting on a Thursday, March 9th at 6.30 a.m. in room 110. All are welcome to join. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact Melissa Hess and Hannah Fair. For Mrs. Gordianko and the Pendulum staff, to all Pendulum staff writers, there will be a meeting on Monday, March 13th at 2.30 p.m. in room 374. Everyone should plan to attend. If you cannot attend, please contact Mrs. Gordianko or one of the editors. Fellowship of Christian Athletes and the Dodgeball Tournament. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will be hosting their annual Dodgeball Tournament on March 25th in our white gym. Team packets can be picked up in room 218. The cost is $10 per person and teams are guaranteed at least two games as well as a free lunch. The winning team members will be given Wawa gift cards. All forms are, and money are due by Tuesday, March 21st. See Sam Yathers with any questions. That's all for me, Penners. Now to Canberra with your weather and lunch. Thanks, Joe. This is Cam. Woo! Woo! Bird. It's going to be 59 degrees Fahrenheit with a high and a low of 39 degrees. It's going to be turning sunny and show gusts of wind. For lunch, chicken fajitas, veggie burger, steamed corn, tossed salad, and of course, your choice of milk. Seniors, it's exactly three months until we graduate. Continue powering through the year and have a great day, Penridge.